Yo guys and welcome to another video and in today's video as you can see we have a epic new setup and this is a huge change for me so I definitely wanted to make a video on it. Uh, I've been saying for months I'm going to do this, I'm going to get a desk and everything like that and I finally did it yesterday. I was going to do a video of me assembling it and stuff like that and like putting the drawers together and stuff like that but I just decided to do it all off camera when I was free and uh, yeah I've kept it all for today to put in a video. I did post some pictures on my Instagram earlier today of it so if you want to go see some like still pictures of it go check it out and i did a bit of posing around with it because i'll be using this for the fed going forward of course and uh, there's still a lot of improvements to make uh, there's a lot of crowd things i want to do over here uh, i should have some crowd things on the way which i've like got made um so yeah i look forward to that it's literally just a few more of these but my goddamn printer ran out of ink so i had to order some but uh, they should be better quality anyway so i can't wait for that uh, I may even put some up here, like behind, you know, like the Royal Rumble 2020 stage, where there's people sit, sat behind the entrance stage. If I have any spare, I might put some there. I also think I might need another lamp or an extension cable, because this running across here with my legs here, that cannot go. Um, so yeah, I'll have to look into that as well. So a lot of improvements to make, but I still wanted to show you guys what it looks like now. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll take you through it. Uh, so I ordered these drawers like a few week, like last week, I think. And they came here today, I actually didn't expect them for another week, uh, so this was a surprise, came in a massive box. And yeah, I, re I mainly got these because the boxes were caving in, they were breaking and everything, and these drawers take up a lot less room. Uh, so the way I've sorted them is, here we have like the main Raw guys for BFW Raw. Uh, so we got like the Apollo in there, we got the Champions, stuff like that. And in here we have like the Raw lower card, or mid card, or whatever you want to say. And some just guys who don't appear, like John Cena. And then, then below there, we have the SmackDown roster with the champions and everything. And then below that, you guessed it, the mid card slash lower card guys. So yeah, that's all I went for for the drawers, and they fit here pretty nicely. Uh, I was going to fit them in this little gap here, but it just it's not big enough. So yeah, that kind of sucks, but I don't mind them there. Uh, there's still enough room to get my chair here. Look how much more room I have here. This is where my arena was before. I've got so much more room. For activities here and uh yeah and under here this is where my old boxes went to use in here we have just alternate attires and stuff like that and spare figures we've got like a bunch of jeff hardy's in there a bunch of cm punks well one C two cm punks uh, we've got some Rey mysterios matt hardy's then below there with a cracked lid this is all i had this is just spare crowd members and crap fodder i don't use uh so yeah these are just spare crowd members that wouldn't fit on the desk that i had in the crowd before so yeah they're there if i ever need them and a bit of fodder then moving across into the other box i've tried to organize my accessories and weapons and stuff like that so we have ladders in here we have chairs down here we have like kendo sticks and barbed wire stuff we have the spare announce table we have like the festival of friendship thing just a bunch of different stuff in here and uh, yeah it's nice and neat so i can just pick it out whenever i want it i'm going to try to keep my setup clean uh for once because this always used to get mumble jumbled and whatever and yeah that was annoying and in here in this other box this is where i used to keep my spare tires but uh, i decided to put them in a bigger box because that'll probably grow anyway in here i just decided to throw in a bunch of fodder uh, that i do use sometimes so we have like what's this carl anderson thigh joint or something i don't know maybe a sting thigh joint uh we have like a, a jacket right there shinsuke nakamura jacket we've got a bunch of stuff in here that i may use and uh, yeah, there's some more stuff there, like stuff I might use, like tag tiles and other titles and stuff like that. So yeah, just a bunch of random stuff. And then here we have just boxes that I didn't use. Uh, crowd backboards or whatever, random box. A few more random boxes back there. And yeah, that's pretty much underneath. So, yeah, when I'm fed in, I can just push my chair over here. I can just skid along from here into here and yeah, pretty easy. So that's awesome. So much more room for activities, man. And yeah, I just kept the cell down there. Fits nicely down there. There's the mats I used to use. Uh, you guys remember I used these mats. They got really, like, damaged over the time I used them. Like, inflated and stuff like that. So the figures would be hard to balance on. But at least now I've got wood. Um, it's, like, like, a lot more straight and, you know, flattened out or whatever. So it's a lot easier to balance them on. Now on to the arena. And yeah, it's... Same ring, of course, that I always use for like past two years, three years or something. And yeah, I really do want some like different ropes or something because I'm sick of the raw brand. I wish I had like a custom ring or something. But this is all I've got for now. And yeah, you know, same old ref. 
commentary table, stuff like that. I put a few boxes along here just for the backdrop before it leads to like the cliff of death. So if someone gets speared through there, they're falling all the way down there, you know. That's how it's going. And here we just have a bunch of random crowd members. And you may notice at the back, I've never actually had this before, we have a crowd backdrop. I uh, printed all this out with... Uh, someone on Instagram sent me the graphics, I can't remember his name right now, but if you go over to the post on Instagram, you'll be able to see who. Uh, he sent me these and I decided to print some out with the ink I had left. I ran out of ink though, that's why it ends, and the pages aren't very big. Uh, but I will have some other ones on the way for a better crowd backing, and uh, yeah, that should look really cool. And then over here we have the main crowd area, just a bunch of like random stuff, a bunch of random figures, and yes, yeah, we've got a few here as well. Here's this light which I have knocked off a few times because it's like it's hanging right here, so that's annoying. So I may have to get an extension for that. And yeah, just put a few boxes down the side of uh, people on the roster. So we've got Jeff, Ricochet, Pete Dunn, and yeah, the main entranceway looks pretty nice, I think. For now, I may switch this up uh, for Battleground and uh, for future shows. I want to I want to try and make a big stage for SummerSlam. So yeah, I look forward to that. Uh, we have the BFW live sign as always, more boxes over there, I put a bit of scaffolding up here, just to top it off. And yeah, on my drawers over here we got the photo and stuff, I always use, like spare hands and stuff. So yeah, everything's really accessible from where I'm sitting, so I'm like sitting down right now. So yeah, up there we have the display and everything, you know how it is, some of my favourite figures up there. Damn, looking awesome. So yeah, it's really cool, and obviously we've got the Avengers poster, the most important wrestling figure arena item that's what you always need avengers endgame poster right there and yeah that's pretty much it for the arena uh let me know your thoughts and what you think i could do to improve it because there's definitely room for improvement on here uh one thing i am worried about is like the desk scratching if i use it uh, for like fedding so i'm gonna have to try to be very gentle uh from now on even though i, I was i was before but you know i have to be super careful now so i don't damage the figures or whatever or the desk itself but yeah, thank you for watching this arena tour, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. Be sure to leave a like on the video, smash that subscribe button, and I'll see you all in the next video.